All right, so what we're showing you here is the Vortex 6 to 36 by 56 Razer HD Gen 3. Uh, this is a mill version, you'll see, by the .1 MRAD there, and the nice tens, ones and tens all the way around. So what Vortex did with this scope is a brand new turret, unlike anything else out there, and it is called the LTEC Plus Zero Stop System with micro adjustment dial, which would be that part. So what that does is allow you to fine tune your zero in between clicks. So on an MRAD scope, the clicks are about one third of an inch at 100 yards. Um, basically, if you've got a group that or a rifle that can shoot very tiny groups, you can actually see a difference where you're clicking from side to side of center when you're trying to zero. So what this does will let you go in between clicks, basically. And it is the only system like it that I'm aware of uh, is the one that Vortex has done. And they took their current system and actually improved it. So basically to start out, you will use this little handy tool that they include to loosen this set screw. And you'll notice the set screw is offset. And the reason for that is because there's a split ring type deal around here and this screw travels tangentially to the turret so it is pinching that collar onto the stem as opposed to the normal convention of just about every other scope on the planet where you've got little grub screws going around um, indenting and, and grabbing onto the stem so again this is a locking turret so you have to lift to turn so, however, when you're zeroing the gun, you don't lift and turn. So now that we've loosened that, spinning this is how we do the fine tune on the zero. So I actually have this gun zeroed, so I'm going to try and turn it and put it back to where it was. So you can just turn it with your finger. Uh, you can also use this handy little tool to turn it. And basically that lets you get a fine-tuned zero in between clicks. So that is how you zero the scope. Dialing the turret is not how you zero the scope. So again, we loosen this, and then you use the center micro-adjust dial to actually bring your shots to zero. And once you're there, you can lock this back up and now you dial the turret like normal and you'll see on this scope there's 10 mils per rev so the MOA version will have either 25 or 35 uh, I'm not sure because the one I have is mil so Again, that was the LTEC Plus Zero Stop system, and hopefully that helps the new uh, Razer Gen 3 owners out there, and they'll be able to set their zero right away.